My next guest is 86 years old and has never been sick a day in his life. He says it's because of his diet. He eats the same thing for dinner every day. Hot dogs. Please welcome Charlie Kazan. <laughs> That's a sharp-looking hat. Thank you very much. Now Oscar Mayer. Oh, it is an Oscar, oh, it's an Oscar Mayer hat. Okay. <laughs> now, you haven't been wearing that for 86 years, have you? No, about five years. About five years. Yeah. So you always wear the hat? Well, I'm identified by the hat. Oh, I see. So they know you. You're the guy with Everybody the hat. Everybody sees the hat says, I've seen you on television. Oh, I see. I see. Well, <laughs> you don't see many guys in baseball caps, no. so that's pretty rare. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, let me ask you about, the, uh, about this hot dog. Thing. You have hot dogs every day for dinner? Every day. Two hot dogs for dinner. Boiled, fried? Boiled. Each hot dog wrapped in a slice of bread. Yeah. And a cup of coffee. You ever fry them? No, no. Fried foods is not healthy. <laughs> <laughs> it's not healthy to fry No. Because no. you know what we would do? See, what I do is you boil it for like five minutes, then just fry it to get it a little crunchy on the outside. No? No, no. That's unhealthy. They, they don't even fry steaks. They broil them. Oh, so that's wrong. Well, they broiled it. tastes better. <laughs> healthier. So it's healthy. Now, is a hot dog really healthy? Well, I have the proof of 85 years. Yeah. But you I never did. ate anything else to prove? Well, everything else comes up on me. Hot dogs don't. And they keep me healthy. <laughs> keep me healthy. Now, do you, do you have mustard and relish and a lot oh, of... Oh, no, no. That would come up on me. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. That would shorten my life. So you like... You like basic natural food, like a plain, all natural hot dog. All plain. All plain. Because I can taste the f full flavor of the meat. I see. <laughs> now, wh when, did you, when did you start this? Well, when I was 11 months old. 11 months old? I couldn't digest any kind of food that my mother cooked for the other kids. So she kept me on cream of wheat. Finally, on one Sunday, she boiled a kettle of hot dogs, yeah. not to make a big dinner. And as the kids were eating, and my mother was cooking the cream of wheat. I reached over, the kids hand me a hot dog. And you ate the hot dog. And I nibbled on it about a third of the way through. The kids hollered, Ma, Charlie's eating and it's not coming up. Hola! <laughs> so, I mean, when you were like, when you were like 40, did you think that something else might taste different than a hot dog? I tasted everything. Oh, I have. And hot dogs are the only way to go. No, the only thing that would stay down. Now, do you ever get tired of hot dogs? Well, the truth is that every time I eat two hot dogs at dinner time, it, they taste like it's, I only had it for the first time. The first time? Yeah. And so I say, well, I'll what have a woman tomorrow. wouldn't want a man to say that, really? Well, <laughs> so I say... It's like, oh, with you, it's the first time. Really, every time you buy a hot dog, it's like... It's like a new, exciting taste That's after right. 63,000 hot dogs? Yeah. So I say I'll have them tomorrow night also. Yeah. And then the and night after. Now, can you... We have a couple of different hot dogs. You can identify them? Oh, yes. I'm a hot dog man. I taste, yeah, yeah. I've tasted every, every hot dog on the market. How about... You prefer... Now, I guess by the hat, you like Oscar Mayer. Yeah. Now, I, how, how about, like, a Hebrew National? Aren't they all national? Well... Na a natural it, one. I can't eat Hebrew, Hebrew National because they uh, have uh, ingredients of... Uh, garlic in them. Oh, it's got and, garlic. And I can't digest oh. garlic. How about Nathan's? I used to love Nathan's when I was a kid. That was the best hot down dog in, to me. Down in Coney Island. Oh, yeah. Nathan's, yeah? Yeah. You don't like but those. They got garlic. Oh, they got garlic. <laughs> mm. uh, Mike, hot dog? No, but I would like to point out that those are Oscar Mayer wieners, and my name is Mike Myers. <laughs> don't get confused. <laughs> well, how about Ballpark, the plump up ones? The ballpark to me is the second best hot dog on the market. Oh, second best? Yeah. Oh, yeah. so in, in an emergency situation, you're on the road, you can't find an Oscar Mayer, <laughs> boom, you'll go to Ballpark. That's right. Okay. I mean, have you ever had a situation where you're stuck in a hotel? There's no hot dogs you got up there. Do you, you travel with hot dogs? No, I travel with bologna. Oh, with bologna. I stop in the supermarket, <laughs> buy a pound of bologna, oh. a quart of milk, and I pull off in the oh, truck stop and I'm eating oh, oh, bologna and milk. All right. Veronica, would you like a hot Would you uh, offer one to Veronica? Uh, uh, would you like a hot dog? I heard, no, I heard that hot dogs sometimes have rat hair in them. Is that true? No. I'm no, serious. No, I heard no, that. No, it's not true. No, Maybe it's only no. in New York, see, where I live. See, every hot dog and meat 
on the deli well, here you go, Charlie. Have a hot contains, dog. Contains. Yeah. That, yeah that, have that, that one right there. We'll be and, right back right after this. Charlie Kazan, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Mike, would you like a hot dog? I want to thank my guests, uh, Charlie. Congratulations on your hot dog diet. It seems to thank work. Thank you very much. So God bless you. I'm glad you're in good shape.